Mountain Blade is a uh, single player action RPG game. Uh, our objective in the, uh, making the game was uh, making a very realistic uh, medieval game. Uh, most medieval games are really uh, more about um, magic and uh, point and click combat. What we uh, wanted to make was uh, make a game like uh, medieval movies uh, where you can really control your sword and your fighting and you can ride a horse and fight against uh, mounted opponents. Uh, most of the battles um, involve uh, large parties, large war bands, so you don't have to fight along. You, you, can, uh, uh, you can have your own war band and your own war band uh, can be uh, quite big, for example, like uh, you can have as many as, many as 50, 100 uh, soldiers fighting with you. Uh, so uh, the game really starts like a uh, role-playing game, but as you play along, uh, it becomes more of a uh, it becomes more like a strategy game. It's a, a free-form game game world, but uh, as you become stronger, uh, you can uh, recruit soldiers from villages, and if you can keep them alive, then they will uh, level up. Is there a story element to this? Uh, there, there, there is no uh, strict storyline that you have to follow, uh, but what we tried to do was that there is a very dynamic world, so it has own, its own dynamic properties. There are five kingdoms which are fighting for supremacy over uh, the land, uh, and you can join one of the kingdoms, uh, and uh, these kingdoms are playing like a uh, strategy game in their own right. So uh, if, you, uh, if you just watch them, what is happening, uh, you will see them for example, declaring war against each other and then collecting armies and going to besiege each other's towns and castles. I mean, they uh, happen automatically, but uh, also you can uh, take part in the action. Uh, you can uh, just join in uh, one of the kingdoms uh, as a mercenary or you can become a vessel of uh, one of the kings. What you play in the game becomes like a story. I mean, it becomes very involving. So uh, it's, it's, you don't have a story in the game, but basically, um, I mean, you can live your own story. And this is all before the game has been released, uh, yeah, yeah. officially. Uh, has the open beta, which has been going for a long time, been working out for you? We started it uh, as a garage project, uh, and I was doing the programming, and uh, my wife was doing the uh, graphics of the game. Uh, we came up with an idea to release it. Uh, we said, OK, we won't be able to finish this game ever. So what we can do is that we can uh, release it as a beta version and tell the players that um, they can buy the game uh, at that point and uh, if they buy the game they, they will be able to download the final version for free if it's ever released uh, and uh, with their money we will be able to uh, continue the development of the game uh, so um, we were a bit anxious about this uh, whether this uh, plan would work out but it worked extremely well and we got a very positive response we soon um, had lots of players that supported, supported the game All right. thank you very much thank you